For those who are familiar with SQL, we have another option called Query Parameters. This allows you to create a SQL query that contains references to data that lives in particular cells in your file. For example, let's say I have this Chicago taxi report that I've built with a dropdown that shows different taxi companies in Chicago. I can write a query that will then update depending on the value in that dropdown. To do this, let's edit my underlying query. So if I go back to my preview and click the gear icon, I can choose Write Custom Query at the bottom. Here, we can see that what we really have is a simple select star from a particular table query. Let's make this a little more advanced by adding a where clause and say where company equals. And I'll go to the right and choose Add under Query Parameters, select my dashboard sheet, and then click on the cell within that dropdown. So now, my results are going to be a select star from the Chicago taxi table where company equals the value in that dropdown. Let's update my report now. Let's change the dropdown value, open up the refresh options, also available from each individual item's overflow menu, and then click Refresh All to update this report. If I change the company again and hit Refresh All again, we can see the report again changes based on the new value being passed into the query. Music